Hey everybody, Concealed Tactics here. Um, wanted to give you an update on Aegis Armory uh, holsters here. Um, Stephen from Aegis Armory sent me a couple samples here that I'm really falling in love with here. Uh, as uh, you guys know, I'm a big fan of his uh, shield holster, okay? Um, and you've seen a couple reviews up, but uh, what I wanted to show you today is the Guardian. And he sends it with the paracord on there. And the sheath. And if I say stealth or something wrong, it's sheath. I, I constantly type this wrong for him and he <laughs> he laughs about it. Because I always spell it wrong. Uh, but it is sheath. Um, I wanted to show you these. These are they're similar but yet different. These are originally meant for the guys that like to carry uh, appendix style. And you can loop this around your belt, and then uh, you got this wedge in your pants there in the front, and then as you pull out, it releases from the trigger. Okay? And they, they're basically a trigger guard, which is nice. But I want to tell you, you can use these for a lot more. Um, and I want to show you, even though they're similar, there are some different uses for these. Um, I use both of these in the various ways. Um, they are awesome for if uh, you just want to keep something, an extra something in the closet, um, hanging on the door, by your bedpost. These are awesome, but the biggest thing I found for them is the ability to, uh, that's why I've removed this one, or the, uh, the paracord on this one, is for the simple fact that now I can toss this in my pocket. I can uh, put this in between my car seats. I can uh, put it in the small of my back as I'm walking out to go get the mail if I'm not carrying something with me. I don't have to throw in my holsters and everything else. So I use this um, so many other ways. And it's just the ability and have the flexibility to um, at least feel safe about picking up something or and, and being able to put it in a quick area, like I said. I use it with the 26 or some of the other ones to just to throw it in my pocket. Um, this one, uh, I will tell you, I do use it a lot of times when I'm coming home and I, I, I take it out of this holster and I'll throw, throw it in here. At least I know that this is now, that the trigger is safe and I don't have to worry about anything happening to it. And even without the lanyard on it, as long as he's designed this so that from the front, all you have to do is pop that down. You can just grab it so it's not like a big deal it, it pulls right off very easily there that wasn't very good on camp camera for you but uh, but all you have to do is just rotate it down like this and it'll pop right off so it works awesome for that the sheath works very very similar in the manner but it's more of a clamshell design and then you could release it from here but the benefit of it is the fact that even though I could carry this, and I feel it, it, the retention on it is very, very good. I I feel safe, but the retention is you're 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 carrying the gun in sort of this position um, with the lanyard hanging upside down, and uh, not that it's a bad thing, but it's sturdy. I'm not worried about it ever falling out. But for this clamshell design he came up with is very nice because it lets you carry it in this position and with the clamshell design it covers the hood of the gun the, the muzzle of the gun and you can suspend a much heavier weight off of it so this is made for my 26 um i believe you can make it for the, any of the other ones um but you can now carry a heavier weight and uh what i do with this this particular model, which is awesome, is the fact that I can take this, and this is where the extra paracord comes in. I actually have to go buy some, as I swing it over like a shoulder holster. Now, he has a video where he shows it as a, as a shoulder holster. He just sort of swings it over one shoulder. I made it so it goes over my head and around my, uh, my body, just like a regular shoulder holster. This hangs perfectly underneath my T-shirt so that it's sitting right there and all I have to do is this to release it so 
I can now, if I don't want to throw in a holster, and I'm just wearing some shorts and a t-shirt, I can run up to the mailbox or walk around, and this is pretty much just hanging underneath my shirt in the right position, almost like a shoulder, you know, like a normal shoulder holster, a little bit more free-floating, but I don't have to worry about the weight, I don't have to worry about anything, I'm, I know this isn't going to come out. Um, I will tell you one thing, I didn't tell, I didn't know Steven was going to send this, and I didn't tell him the Glock 26 has a laser on it, so if you do order one of these from him, which is a, a great holster, you can see I had to actually notch out a little bit more so that it would clamp, uh, lock on and retain with the uh, with the laser on it, that was the only thing, and that's not his fault. I didn't know he was sending it, and I didn't tell him I had a laser. But if you do tell him, he will modify the holster and have it ready for you if you have a laser on there already. Um, can both of these be used very similar ways? Yes, you can take it, and I use this one in between the car seat also because there's a lot of times I've got this on, and I can just swing it over my shoulder, throw it out there. Even if I don't have it under my shirt, I can just whip it around there. If I'm walking out on the farm, I can have this over my shoulder and then take it off just before I get in the cart and put it in between the car seat and, and the console, and it, it's ready to go. You don't have to have this on here to release it. If you need to release it, all you have to do is push up or pull on this, and it pulls right off. But it does carry the extra weight of the gun and carries it in a different position. So, um, two nice nice holsters from Aegis Armory. Um, similar in style and versatility, but different uses altogether. So, uh, you can use them very, very much the same way. You can throw this in your pocket. Um, you can do the same kind of thing with this, but they do carry a little bit different and their uses are a little bit more extreme. Um, so I would try, and you know, and this one, um, much better for, like I said, running around carrying a gun uh, underneath your shirt a little bit differently because it can carry the weight of it and you, and you don't have to worry about it. This one, it's just great, versatile, nice little holster. You can throw them in your pockets. And here's the one thing about the Glocks. I will tell you this, with the 26, it's this is meant for the 26, so pretty much this is just for this gun. The beauty part about this is this can come off here and can go on my 30, can go on, my, on the 26. They all fit, so if you have one of these, so if, if prices and uh, money is an issue, um, this might be the better way to go because it's going to be much more versatile. If you have one Glock, it'll pretty much fit all your Glocks. Um, uh, this one is going to be specific for whatever gun you choose to get it made for. So, a um, little bit difference there, and this is a little bit more expensive, I believe. Uh, I think more in the 25 or 30 dollar price range. Uh, don't, I'll check and put it in the video. Um, this is in the $15 price range. So, for $15, bucks, you have got one holster that can go on uh, multiple guns if you have the same style gun. So, it's, you know, I, like I said, I pretty much deal with Glocks. I'm not sure about how the, uh, you know, Smith & Wessons and all the other ones are, but if you guys know your guns, I'm sure you'll know that if the trigger guards are pretty much all the same, I would think they would be. Um, so, economy route, I guess. A little bit more expensive route and specific, but I want you guys to see it. Uh, another good product from Aegis Armory. Um, the sheath, uh, see I almost said self, the sheath and the guardian. Um, the uses, I'm still coming up with them. So between hanging in the closets, being able to go and put it in my car seats and go from here to there, um, the versatility is great. I don't have to always throw in a holster, and that's what's nice about it. I can stick it in a pants pocket, do whatever I need to do, whip it around my shoulder. All right, guys, uh, just a little update on that. If I come up with any more uses of it that are more unique, um, personally, I keep this also, one of these, um, with a gun on my bedside. So uh, it's ready to go. All I have to do is flip it off, and I'm ready to go. So it's another use for it, bedside. Alright guys, Concealed Tactics out, enjoy, uh, let me know what you think, leave some comments below.